Mwanaharakati aliyetiwa mbaroni hapo jana baada ya kuzua rabsha nje ya ofisi za Wizara ya Hazina ya Kitaifa ameachiliwa baada ya kutoa faini ya shilingi 5000. Julius Kamau Kimani alionekana akibebwa na maafisa wa usalama waliomtia kwenye gari kabla ya kumpeleka katika kituo cha polisi cha Central kwa kosa la kuzua rabsha alipoachiliwa mwanaharakati huyu alisisitiza kuwa ataendelea kutetea haki za wakenya japo hawakumtetea alipokuwa nakabiliwa na maafisa wa usalama Kimani anasema kuwa alikuwa anatetea wakenya wanaoendelea kuzongwa na masaibu ya kupanda kwa gharama ya maisha nchini In Sri Lanka, the press, the people are telling the president to resign. The camera police and nuns have joined. We shall overcome our people. Why? Why should you arrest? I've been doing this for almost 10 years, telling the same Kenyans, the same Kenyans who are saying that that we are the people who will rise up one day and get angry and say we do not want this system. It's gone too much. We don't need donors to do the, to do that. We don't need to be funded to do that. So always when I go and most of the times I'm found in the streets of Nairobi doing that giving that message. So I don't think there's anybody anakuanga menituma. Hata polisi wananishikanga wanasema wewe umetumwa na nani? Naambia hakuna mtu amenituma. The way I feel in my heart consciously because we must be the generation that will change this country.